everybody welcome to uh rich's video series uh make sure you click the subscribe button and click the bell to receive more notifications today's video is on mazak maze programming lathe with live tool and we're gonna be doing od hole drilling all right so here's what we're gonna be doing here we'll be taking this uh boss hoss spot drill here got 750 spot drill we got a nice uh quarter inch drill here we're going to be drilling uh, some OD holes in this stock here. All right, so we're going to use program 29. So we're going to go left soft key. Program. So we're going to go work number 29 input. And here's our program 29. Okay, so. We're going to go program edit so that it's edit and we're going to go carbon steel. We're going to go 2.5 OD max, zero ID minimum. We go length of 7.1, work face 0.1. RPM at 2500. Okay, now that we've got our um, um, title, now we're going to cursor down and we're going to go with point machining. Usually we go with turning because that's how you do facing and turning, but we're going to go with point machining because we're going to machine a point for drilling. Anytime you want to be doing drilling, you pick point machining. Okay, so we're going to do point machining. And then you can do drilling, counter bore, reaming, tapping, boring, back counter bore, counter bore, tap, circle mill. We're going to be doing drilling. All right, now, when you're doing face drilling, you can use these. If you're doing OD drilling, you want to use these. So we're going to do ZY. There's four selections. There's ZC, XC. ZY, XY. We're going to use ZY to do OD drilling. Okay, now it's asking for our C position. Our C position, I always like to start machining at zero for the C position. The C position is going to be the number of degrees that that spindle turns. So if it, if it did a C of zero, it would be right here. If it did a C of 90, it would rotate 90 degrees and then do it. I should go this way and then uh, drill another hole so c is the number of degrees of the actual uh, degrees of the spindle okay diameter is going to be diameter of our drill hole which is 250. depth we'll just go with the generic depth of a half inch and chamfer we're going to go with zero um chamfer on there for now it's still going to spot drill it it's just going to spot drill it and not put a chamfer on it Okay, so that's our header, ZY, C of zero, diameter 250, depth of 0.5, chamfer of zero. Okay, now our tooling header pops up. And our tooling header, let's start with the first, uh, number one, our center drill. The center drill out, 0.8 nominal, it's actually 750, but 0.8 is fine for the nominal size. Uh, it's the whole diameter is 250, 90 degree tool, it's a center drill cycle, and then we get to the cutting speed. We're gonna cursor the cutting speed here. And then we can just come on here and hit carbide auto. And it'll auto set some feeds and speeds in there. Okay, then a cursor down. Actually, that should have been high speed steel auto since I have high speed steel tools in there. All right, now we are gonna go to drill. <clears throat> so drill, everything looks good. We're gonna get the cutting speed. And again, we're going to go auto set. Okay, now it looks pretty good. So we got my uh, header for drilling. We got my tooling header, center drill and drill. Now I'm going to cursor down. And now is the actual program. All right, so it starts up our little menu down here. We got point, arc, line, and square. Okay, so on this video, we're going to be doing uh, just a point. 
Once you hit the point, it's going to ask you for your start point Z. Now that's the distance from the face of the part. So we're going to go one inch. Start point Y, that's your Y. Are you going to come off center in the Y axis? Chances are you're not going to unless you've got a milled surface on there. So start point Y is going to be zero. Start point R. Now let's look at this and talk about this for a second. Because start point R, when you come down here, it's asking you for starting point R. So what is the radius of the stock that you're going to be start drilling at? So we got two and a half inch stock. What would your R value be? If you had two and a half inch stock, your start point R value would be 1.25. Okay. P, that's your path. So we're using ZY, so that's going to equal zero. And our return position is always going to be one. Okay, once you know that, then you can hit shape end. All right. And then you can hit end again to end the program. And there is our Mesa Troll program for drilling one hole on the outside diameter of a part. Okay, we're going to go right soft key. We're going to go program. We're going to go tool path. And here's our part. We're going to go part shape. And then we can see our part. There's our cross drill right there. There's our stock. There's our cross drill. And then if we were look at the face of the part, this is what it would look like. There's our depth. Okay. All right, so that's my video on uh, face drilling um, one hole. Thanks and have a nice day. And remember to subscribe to my channel, YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye.